An incline plane is a simple machine that makes lifting objects easier. In order to lift something, you must do some work. The amount of work you do is equal to the force you use, or the effort of your pull, times the distance you apply it. An incline plane makes things easier by changing the direction and the distance you push or pull. This also changes the amount of force you need to use. Let's see how this works by lifting a suitcase one meter up into a van. The suitcase weighs 120 newtons. Newtons are a way to measure force, such as weight. Without the plane, you would need to lift with a force of 120 newtons for one meter. This would take 120 newton meters of work. The inclined plane will make doing the same amount of work easier. Our inclined plane will be a three meter plank leaning against the back of the van. Adding wheels to the suitcase will decrease the friction between it and the plank. Friction always makes doing work harder. Without any friction, you would need to push the suitcase with only 40 newtons of force. But now you have to push for three meters instead of just one. You still did the same amount of work as lifting because you used 40 newtons of force over three meters. 40 newtons times 3 meters equals 120 newton meters of work. The inclined plane made it easier by changing the angle you push at. Now you don't need to push directly against gravity. You can push with less force than the entire weight of the suitcase. The trade-off is you had to move it over a greater distance. That's how the inclined plane works. You trade force for distance, while the amount of work stays the same. The longer the plank, the less you lift directly against gravity, but the farther you have to push.